welcome back to another video if you are new to my channel my name is fatima in this video i got ready with you guys i transformed myself um but before we get started i want to mention to you guys something i have mentioned it before already in a past video i want to mention to you guys a perfume that i got so the perfume that I want to mention, you guys, is by the brand Dessier. So here's the box of my perfume. So that's the brand right there. So if you don't know what Dessier is, it's a perfume fragrance brand. They are luxury inspired fragrance fragrances, but at a cheaper price. You guys know perfumes could be kind of expensive. They could go up a hundred dollars or you know around that range. All the perfumes that they carry, they're inspired by. Um, more expensive perfumes but for cheaper basically getting the same like product and just for way cheaper you know so does here was kind enough to send me a perfume now it comes with this little paper that says information about your perfume so the one i have is aquatic coconut specific perfume that i got which is aquatic coconut is inspired by mason margiela margiela the last letter the last words sorry the actual perfume comes in this little box i was about to drop it but here it is um but here's how it comes packaged so here is the perfume and and this one smells really good it smells just like clean it smells really nice it's not too girly too like flowery or anything it's it is really nice and clean which i like it reminds me of someone that would just have their life together which i don't have my life together but this makes me feel like i do i do have also uh perfumes for men like colognes i want to gift um your dad your brother your boyfriend whoever a perfume then go to dossier I, I will be leaving in my description box the link to the perfume so you can go and check it out i also do have a discount code if you guys want to save some money um i don't remember the discount code but i'll put it on the screen and also at the bottom so you guys can save some money you know and also thank you to the cr for sending the perfume over and now i'm actually ready i'm gonna be spraying some perfume on oh yeah that smells really good <laughs> is something that i would wear daily every day hey guys hey me guys welcome back to another video so i'm doing my makeup getting ready um so if you guys want to go and get your makeup so if you get ready together then go ahead and do that or or just go and get a snack or anything so if, sorry when i had into my brows i think this one's thicker than this one but oh well i'm just looking like that i already did my brows I have my brows done, I put on concealer and my eyelid so I'm gonna be using the BFF Alondra and Nancy palette. Um, I'm gonna start with shade number 24, which is that yellow shade in the center of the whole palette. Go ahead and start with that eyeshadow. My mirror is so dirty. Cause I'll turn my wolf. I'm gonna place this like on my crease. How are you guys doing? How's your guys' summer going? Let me know. My summer's pretty boring. <laughs> There's not much going on. If there was something going on, then you guys would have seen vlogs, but there's nothing going on. So but yeah, there's really not much going on this summer at all. <laughs> Um, I want to go to the beach before the summer ends So like, well the summer here, you could go to the beach in December <laughs> That's what we did last year, we went to the beach in December and it was still good Um, but like, you know, the actual season Summer, I want to go to the beach before it ends or whatever Or maybe for my birthday, I want to go to the beach My birthday's in September And if we went to the beach in December, we could go in September <laughs> Um I look tired, that's because I am tired. <laughs> I'm honestly so tired, you guys. I could not open my eyes this morning. I could not get up. I woke up like at 7. I was just there, like still half asleep, half awake. And then I hit 9. And that's when I barely got up. I was... What else? Oh yeah, I have a little update on DACA. Well, they put DACA on hold. A, I think it was a judge in Texas decided to put it on hold for what reason i don't know um yeah they put it on hold i think like two weeks ago so the people that were still waiting including me 
that we were still waiting we're on hold that there's not gonna be no further going or nuts up i don't know when when or if they're gonna put it back and continue it but yeah like me i was still under reviewed i had my appointment for the fingerprints in may the 25th of may i think i think today i'm on i'm over 60 days already it's been 60 days since i went to my appointment i'm out of breath um it's been over 60 days i think it's 63 days today since my appointment and i was still under reviewed and especially now i'm on hold we're all in hold if you st still didn't get accepted it's, it's kind of annoying you guys and frustrating and like unfair in a way because like i don't know i just que se resuelva fast because like what the fuck saw that this was like the plan all along to take it off that's why immigration was taking well like that guy was taking so long for people to get approved and that yeah that's what that's what i saw that that was their plan all along but i don't know i'm gonna go in with scorpio which is that one right there really i'm gonna then i'm gonna do like a sunset look <laughs> The other day I had done my makeup and then I went with my boyfriend. I never really do like, I do like my face makeup but not eyeshadow. And I had done my eyeshadow and I did like, um, and I had done like a night, uh, a what, a sunset kind of eyeshadow. <laughs> and my boyfriend said, you're blinding me with the sunset in your eyes. <laughs> oh, this past weekend my, my cousin came from Georgia. Have you guys have seen like some Georgia vlogs that we go visit my cousin and her little kids? Um, well, they came to visit this past weekend. And it was super fun. <laughs> I didn't vlog anything. I wanted to vlog, but I didn't end up vlogging anything. But we had so much fun. They were here for just two days. Well, they got here on Friday, like Friday at midnight. So basically like Saturday. But they, I, they got here Friday. The little girl, she's so cute. She was asking for me. She was like, Conta mi amiga Fatima. She calls me, um, she calls me her amiga. <laughs> or prima, I think. Or both. It was super nice having them here. On Saturday, my parents went to work. And so me and my brother stayed with them here. And, well, we, di we didn't stay here all day. We went to the mall. We spent the whole day at the mall. And then we went to Ross. The, my cousin wanted to go to Ross. Over there where they live, they live in the middle of nowhere, you guys. In the middle of nowhere, so there's no like stores like Ross or freaking mall. There's nothing over there. Even in un, what's it called? Monte. In un monte, so there's like nothing over there. Like padrinos for a quinceañera because they were um, asking my mom for prices of quinceañera dresses. Yeah, guys. Um, yeah, that's what we did this past weekend. It was fun. I'm going with OOTD. All right. Oh yeah, also my brother, he was in a quinceañera. He was a chamelan in a quinceañera. It was so funny seeing him dance because he never liked dancing and seeing him dance. It was just funny. Right after I finished filming this, get ready with me. I'm gonna film another video i'm gonna film a little haul a mini haul que tengo ropa de shein and fashion nova <sighs> so you guys i bought this new primer like a couple weeks ago it's from nyx this is the primer is honeydew makeup primer so that's how it looks right i swear it was placed where it said eight dollars i go to check out and I get home, I check out. Um, <clears throat> I get home and I look at the receipt and it says that it was $16. I went, it was on, it was placed where it said $8. Well, obviously someone could, you know, put it wherever. So I bought this thinking it was $8, but it was really $16. But it was $16 when I had bought it, but I still kept it, I didn't. <clears throat> But I kept it, I didn't return it or anything. I kept it, so. And I have used it a couple of times, this primer. You can mix it in with your foundation or just 
um, before your foundation and honestly the couple times that I've used it I've used it I don't really see a difference so $16 for what but um I'm gonna be using it today I mean si veo una diferencia or what look it's like a oil type of primer it smells good it smells nice my cheeks and then I got <laughs> I'll put some on my cheeks and then my other primer I'm gonna I'm gonna just like do this I don't know I'm gonna put it in my cheeks and then I'm gonna use my other primer for my like t-zone area so vamos a ver maybe if you have like drier skin maybe it'll work for you but I have like normal to dry skin, I have really dry skin. So let me hold you know, but I'm gonna use my same old thing, the Poreless Pretty Primer by e.l.f. So, the week, I think it was last week, um, or two weeks ago, I don't know. I ordered samples of a foundation from Beauty Creations. Yeah, I ordered four different sample shades of their, their foundation. Because I watched this girl, um, her name is Mireya, Mireya M-U-A, if you guys know her then you know, um, she has the beauty creation, uh, foundation, beauty creation foundation a lot, and so she always puts it, posts it on her Snapchat, and she always talks about it on her Snapchat, because she does, like, um, tutorials there, so, on her Snapchat, then you could get free sample shades, you just paid the shipping, which was five dollars and something, so, six dollars <laughs> for the shipping get some samples i got four different ones what i have right here is 4.0 and 4.5 made i yeah uses 4.0 i think and so i grabbed that one because we're kind of like similar you know which i already tested them and the one that matches me the most is 4.5 which um is the darkest shade that i got and there's enough for another another phase another round of foundation <laughs> So yeah, the first time I tried the foundation, it looked really good. So I was like, yes, girl. <laughs> this is the closest foundation that I've gotten to my shade in so long because all the foundations I have, they're super white on me. So, um, I'm gonna blend it with a brush and then go over it with a sponge. So this is an e.l.f. brush, ultimate blending brush, and it's like a foundation brush, I would say. So, so let's do this. That kind of smells good. <laughs> so I blended it with the sponge. On. I think it does look white a bit. You know, this concealer, I feel like it's better if you use just a little bit of it because a little bit goes a long way. So. Um, so yet yeah, then right with my eyes, I went off camera and finished them. I put on my eyelashes, my face, my face looks so white. Contouring palette de la Zizia is from NYX. And this is how it looks. It comes with the contour, highlight, the powder highlight, and then an actual highlighter. So I feel like these are really subtle. They're not like too harsh or anything. So I like it, you know. For my blush, I'm gonna go in with the um yeah her snatch face palette in <laughs> the alandra and Elsie palette um i'm gonna use the blush from here okay take my sponge go over it i put on some highlighter now it's very subtle, nothing crazy. Okay guys, I finished with my lips. I'm now gonna go and strain my hair. I'm gonna sit on a little bun up here. I have to put my strainer in. I haven't plugged it in yet. Um, I just got this new strainer like a couple months ago. So 
because I kind of knew. Kind of know I look. It got a little darker because I had to unplug my lamp, so it looks a little bit darker. So only my ring light is giving me light. I had me a strainer like two months ago, I think, and it's pretty good, but it just doesn't say how hot it is. I don't have like to adjust it, so I have no idea. And I already took box away, so. I don't know, but it's pretty. <laughs> it's pretty. So, hey, protector. Um, this is the one I have. It's gonna cost seven dollars for this small ass thing. Small, and it costs seven dollars. But I'm gonna be using this. It smells really good. So I'm gonna be using this to protect my hair. Según. <laughs> Do you see the steam that came out of there? Oh my god. I have. So here's the first strand, strained. So I'm gonna do this with the rest of my hair and I'll be back. I just finished just straining my hair. Yeah, I'm done. I'm getting ready. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys want more, let me know so I can do more. If you did enjoy it, remember to give it a thumbs up. Also, subscribe down below if you have not subscribed yet. And um, don't forget about the perfume. I will be leaving, leaving everything down below. I will just see you guys in my next video. Okay, bye. <laughs>